Hey makers, this is Dhruvin and today I come up with one of the most requested video. Most of the time in SharePoint list, whenever a new item is created or whenever a item is modified, we are writing some Power Automate flow. But most of the time what happen here is we are using an action when an item is created or modified into Power Automate and what happen here is during every create and every modified, the flow is triggering. But sometimes we have a scenario that we want to trigger our Power Automate flow only on update. Means whenever I'm editing something into my SharePoint list item, only at that time my flow should trigger. So what can I do? Many people are using the different resolutions from the internet, but I'm having one of the easiest option over here. So let's get started. But before that, if you haven't followed me on my Instagram and Twitter so far, please do follow me and if you didn't subscribe my channel so far, please subscribe and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from me. So without further delay, let's get started. So most of the time what happen here is we are using this action when an item is created or modified. So it is always triggering on create and modified both the action. But now we need this only on modified. So what we will do? There is one more action over here. Just scroll down a little bit and there is an action when an item or file is modified. So it is only for the modification. So let's select this action and now let's provide the site address. So I'm providing my site address. I'm just selecting my asset library and now that's it. So what happened here is this action will trigger only on the modification of any list item from the library. And after that, let me just add one compose action for our testing. So I'm just adding that compose action and let's have taste. And now let's save the flow. I saved my flow and now let's go to the SharePoint list to taste the flow. I'm creating new item now. I just added one product pen over here. So the item has been created successfully. Now let's see if the flow ran successfully here or not. So this will not trigger on the item creation. Now let me just modify this item. So I'm just modifying some other item. So we will get a proper picture. So I'm just adding the title as air conditioner and save it. And now this flow should trigger. So let's see. We have a fresh flow and it should only have one run action over here. And here we are. You can clearly say that one second ago the flow ran and now let's check the run item. So this is the action which ran and if we check the output, let's see what we have. So you can see that this is the updated item air conditioner. So that's it for today. This is how we can simply use our power automate flow to be triggered only once when item is modified. Hope this solution is helpful to you. If you are for the first time to my channel, make sure you hit subscribe and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from my channel. Looking for any consultation, the website link is available on the top right corner of the channel cover. Also, don't forget to follow me on my Twitter and Instagram. With this, this is Thruvin signing off. See you in the next session with some amazing content. Till then, have a great day. Goodbye.